Hi everyone, Sean with jazbeescasebreaks.com here doing 2020 Bowman's Best Baseball 8 Box Case Break. Pick your team number 3 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Released yesterday, really nice stuff. Excited to see it again. So, everything ships. Uh, there is no Minnesota Twins spot. All Twins cards are donated. There's no Twins autos. There could be numbered, there could be parallels, stuff like that. All of that's gonna be donated. So, no randomizers, no nothing on that. Four autographs per box, eight boxes. We're looking for 32 different autographs here. Uh, hopefully some really nice low numbered and great names, like these two guys. So, here we go. Here is our list. Last Spot Mojo, Paul Townsend, Yankees, and White Sox. My uh, my utensils. And uh, if you can hand me like two of them. Of course, John. This one's talking right here or whatever. Thanks, yeah, you too, John. You and everybody have a fantastic Christmas Eve today and Christmas and all that other good stuff. Wherever you may be, whatever you may be doing. Hope you're all safe, happy, and healthy. You know? There is Jack and the most sought after one. Zion and LeBron duel. Logo man. Yeah, I know. I was actually surprised. I was like, huh, what is this uh, wet stuff going on? It's confused. I thought the, the world was ending. Uh, it was another sign of the apocalypse, but it just turns out it was rain.
It's raining in Southern California. I mean, some people down here act like that's a, an apocalyptic event, but it's not. Yeah, unfortunately, we were we were all told when we were either born here or moved here that it would never rain. But uh, it's definitely too late, Stephen. <laughs> it's definitely too late. It was too late in two thousand sixteen when uh, they passed on both Deshaun Watson and Patrick Mahomes. That's when, that's when it became too late. Or 17. 17. That sucks, Ryan. Yeah, right, John? People are walking outside, they're like, oh my god, what is this? I have to wear, wear real shoes with, with where my toes are not covered? Writing, uh, writing angry, angry letters to Gavin Newsom. Fix the weather. What do you mean graded? I'm not sure what that means. What do you mean, Jack? Oh, get traded. Um, honestly, only way I could ever see that happening. Uh, the only way I could ever see him get traded because I think I'm pretty sure his ex his contract that he signed has a no trade. Uh, so it would have to be approved by him no matter what. But the only way I see that happening is let's say that Kansas City builds like this superstar roster of players. So let's say like. Travis Kelsey, obviously. He's really good, right? But then he ends up in... Uh, I was on there earlier, Ray. I, I, was try, uh, I was trying to remember what your Instagram name was so that I could message you. It's all good, man. Um, I'm going to be on there late tonight as well. So, sorry. I wasn't able to get to you th today. But... Um, I can see... The only way I can see Patrick Mahomes getting traded is that let's say everybody else gets really, really expensive on the team and they're no longer able to afford... Fielding a overly competitive team, right? And then at some point, his contract down the line becomes not the Uber contract that it is, but more of a... Well, that's a pretty high contract. Awesome, right? Awesome. Um, becomes... You know, more of like a, it's a high, it's an expensive contract, but not like, oh my God, bend over backwards type thing, right? Then I could see him, if the Chiefs aren't able to field a competitive team anymore, if they really fall off the cliff, uh, then I could see him potentially, you know, being moved to a team that has a plethora of other stuff. But other than that, honestly, there's no way that it's happening. But Brendan, I don't, I don't see, I don't see him having a fallout with the owner because one, let's be honest, as much as as a Chargers fan I am, I want to hate Patrick Mahomes. He seems like such a li likable guy. You know what I mean? Like, he seems like somebody you'd want to introduce, you know, everybody to, and just be like, 
Yeah, he's pretty great. Um, but remember, he's also he's also part owner owner now of the Kansas City Royals. So I'm sure he can now kind of appreciate the things that an owner, even though it's probably more in name than in action at all with the Royals. Um, I'm sure he can kind of appreciate a little bit of that aspect and what owners have to deal with or the financial strain or this or that. Weird to say financial strain when the guy just signed a half a billion dollar contract, but you know, there's still cost cost balance analysis that have to be run on, you know, billion dollar organizations too. Oh, 100%. You mean like uh, Jim Ursay from the Colts? That guy. Just so dumb. I don't understand how uh, people like him have not... And uh, what's his name? James Dolan from the Knicks. How uh, owners like that have not had their franchises taken away from them. What up, Jack? How are you, man? Well, oh, thank you guys for hanging out. And uh, Merry Christmas Eve to everybody. Ow! My arm! Put me on the DL, guys. It's over with. I'm out. Gavin Lux, Dodgers, Brian Lutz. Carter Keboom, Gold, Franchise 2020, 33 out of 50. Washington, Courtney Bishop. And our first auto, Max Muncy, Green to 99, also for the Dodgers and Brian Lutz. Luis Robert, Chicago White Sox. Paul Townsend, Last Spot Mojo. Jesus Lazardo, Purple to 250. Going to the A's and Chris Walker. Ooh, Brendan, that's so cool. Oh, that's right. Brendan, Merry Christmas, buddy. Brendan's in uh, good old Melbourne. Ari Stedis Aquino for the Reds, Kurt Disser. Ronald Acuna Jr. There you go. Starting off with a bang. Braves, Ryan Kaysen. There you go, man. You know what's funny, Jack? Somebody mentioned it yesterday. They were like, hey, the new the new hockey schedule should make this year really interesting with the fact that it's like it's like back to backs. And then I just saw, I just saw the Devils posted, uh, posted their their little their four games in a row against the the giant. Uh, I mean the the Rangers, and it said it said uh, what did it say? It said uh, the NHL uh, asked asked for violence, and they're gonna get it. And I was like, or something like that. They posted on Twitter, and I saw that they were playing four games back to back, and I was like, this is gonna be fantastic. If that happens across the league for rivalries, it's going to be so much fun. This might be the greatest hockey season of all time. As long as everybody can stay healthy. Dylan Dingler, Refractor Auto. Detroit Tigers, Eric Craig. Brendan McKay, Tampa Bay Rays, Eric Bailey. Gavin Lux, Refractor for the Dodgers, Brian Lutz. I like this look of this set. That's super cool. Uh, Pete Alonzo, Atomic Refractor. For the Mets, Armando Montero. Spencer Torkelson Refractor for the Tigers. Eric Craig. 
And our fourth otter, Otto, Carter Keeboom for the Nationals and Courtney Bishop. Nico Horner, rookie refractor, Cubs, Eric Ainge. Jorge Soler, blue to 150 for the Royals, Rick Conza. Hobbs play Vancouver three games in a row in the first week. Yeah, it's going to be super cool. I like when they, when they said back to backs, I was like, okay, well, I mean, I was like, the Angels typically would play against the Kings in Staples Center, and then, you know, right afterwards, the Kings would come play here. But now that, the, uh, I, now that I see what it is, I was like, oh, this is going to be cool. Honestly, Jack, if they make that happen, um, that's huge for them, but I think that's even bigger for, uh, for Chicago. That guy's good. Luis Robert, White Sox, Paul Townsend. Atomic, Juan Soto for Washington and Courtney Bishop, and... First auto, box two, Trent Grisham. San Diego Padres, Stephen Elliott. Spencer Torkelson, Atomic Refractor as well. Detroit Tigers, Eric Craig. Ari Stettis Aquino, Rookie Refractor. Reds, Kurt Disser. Luis Robert. Power Producers, Refractor, Chicago White Sox, Paul Townsend, and our second auto, Everson Pereira. For the New York Yankees, Paul Townsend, last spot mojo. Uh, Hans, if it's sold out, it's going to break tonight. Yeah. Uh, if you look at the schedule, I'm just waiting on... Uh, I got to go through orders and figure out what the schedule is tonight. Brendan McKay, Tampa Bay Rays, Eric Bailey. You're hearing Dodger? Steven, that would make me so upset. Bo Bichette, Blue Jays, Justin Fuller. Gavin Lux for the Dodgers, Brian Lutz. Jesus Lazardo, Auto. Oakland A's, Chris Walker. Chris Bryant, purple to 250 for the Cubbies, Eric Ainge. Luis Robert, refractor, rookie again for the White Sox, Paul Townsend. Gavin Lux, franchise favorites, refractor for the uh, Dodgers, Brian Lutz. And Nick Gonzalez, refractor auto, Pittsburgh Pirates, seventh overall pick, Darren McKenzie. He's good. Ari Stettis Aquino for the Reds, Kurt Disser, Jason Dominguez, Yankees, Paul Townsend, last spot mojo. I mean, that'd be a good pairing too, Jack, but I don't know, man. I I honestly don't think, I don't know what the Phillies need. I think Bryce Harper kind of leveraged them out of being competitive. Nick Solak, rookie auto to 150 for the Rangers, Nathaniel Smith. Nick Gonzalez again, seventh overall pick. Pirates, Darren McKenzie.
Jesus, Steven, that'd be so dumb. That team already is the next great thing. Franchise favorites, negative Christian Pache for the Braves, Ryan Kaysen. I don't know what the rarity is on those, but they look super cool. I like it a lot. Sean Murphy out of 50 for the Oakland A's, Chris Walker. Nico Horner, Cubbies, Eric Ainge. Heston Kerstad, purple to 250 for the Orioles, Nick Koba. And Atomic Refractor, Nick Gonzalez again for the Pirates, Darren McKenzie. Everson Pereira, auto for the Yanks. Paul Townsend, last spot mojo. Luis Robert, franchise rookie for the White Sox. Paul Townsend, last spot mojo. And Jordan Alvarez, rookie refractor for the Astros. And Jared Morling. talking about Ray what about Luke Kennard Christian Yelich atomic refractor going to the Brewers Jens McLeese and our first auto, Bryce Jarvis, for the Diamondbacks, Eric Craig. Ari Stedis Aquino for the Reds, Kurt Disser. Jordan Alvarez, Power Producers, Refractor. Astros, Jared Morling, and Antonio Cabello, auto, for the Yankees, Paul Townsend. That looks just like uh, Jason Domingos. Emerson Hancock to 99 for the Mariners, Patrick Colon. Purple Flash 35 premium stock. Oh, I'm not even sure, Ray. No clue, man. It's so new that uh, you might have to wait a little bit to see when one other one hits the market. Jordan Alvarez, Houston Astros, Jared Morling. Kyle Lewis, Mariners, Patrick Colon. And Adley Rushman, Baltimore Orioles, Nick Coba, auto there. Nice Jorge Alfaro, Atomic Refractor. Going to the Marlins, Brandon Morocco. And Bo Bichette, Rookie Refractor. Blue Jays, Justin Fuller. Ooh, Mike Trout, Atomic Refractor Auto, 2 out of 25, Los Angeles Angels, Jason Stowe. Wow. Holy. Jason, as an Angels fan, I hope you're a fellow Angels fan. Congratulations, man. Holy Jesus. eBay one of one here. You add the two to the 25, you get 27. Jersey number. eBay one of one, Jason. Don't ever put this on eBay. If you want to sell it, let me know. I would, uh, I would really, really like to. <laughs> I peed myself too, Jason. Don't worry. I can't, Jack. I can't. We are on a heater. If you guys didn't see the stuff that we pulled last night, especially late night, we are on a tear. 
just keep it going. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. For a second there, I honestly thought it was Matt Tice. <laughs> you get so you get so ingrained with seeing MT and the Angels. I thought it was Matt Tice. Well, this is the first half. Man, J Jason. That is awesome, man. I think that might uh that might deserve a picture after this break. Maybe. Just maybe. I think I think Mike Trout makes the cut. Hawaii was called the Rainbow Warriors anymore. I thought they were just the Warriors. I'll take a big shack. Listen. Just to cover my bases, Jack. If for some reason he ever decides to not want to play for the Angels again. And he leaves the team. Or, you know, he holds out or does something. That's like anti-Angel, but good for Mike Trout. I support Mike Trout, a thousand percent. Um, if he decides to go play for another team, I will root for him, and I will root against that team. But. Unless it's the Padres. And in that case, go Padres, all the way. Padres are my NL team. I 
I might if it was a Dodger if, if Mike Trout was a Dodger I might take the picture a little bit off center you know what I mean just a little bit more God Jack he's so good he's so good even even last year with like not a crazy like you know crazy great year you still go look at his stats and you're just like yeah that guy is super good Jack, are you a are you a, Nash, a Nationals fan because of Montreal? Um, Jack, uh, Brendan, I don't think people hate the Padres just because, to be honest, the Padres were so garbage for such a long time. Like it's it's like, did do people hate the Astros? Nobody hated the Astros until four or five years ago, honestly. Because, to be honest, Astros were garbage. They were such a garbage organization that when they got moved from the NL into the AL, people literally were just like, whatever. Nobody cared. They were just like, eh, it is what it is. The Astros are still going to suck whether they're in the NL or the AL. A decade of losing later, you know, here they are. That's cool. I'd like to get up there and visit, um, hang out sometime. What up, Tyler? How are you, man? Merry Christmas Eve to you. I hope everybody's happy, healthy, and safe. If you got all three of those, you're doing pretty well. If you got two of them, it'll still, it'll still work. Yeah, Tar uh, the turf or <laughs> honestly, Brendan, it's not even. You don't even need. You don't even need a, a garbage can. Legitimately, all you need is like absolute success. There are people, honestly, Brendan, that do not like Mike Trout. On you know why? Because of his success. All they'll do is be like, well. He hasn't done anything. He's got zero playoff wins. You know, what's his record in the playoffs? And it's just like, it's a, it's a team sport. Like, all those people are like, oh, we have this many, this guy has this many championships. Okay. Unless it's golf or tennis, that's not an individual sport. Team championships don't count for one person. You know what I mean? Especially in baseball, football, all that other stuff. You're in this for Patrick Bailey? Jason. Well, <laughs> I hope I find you a Patrick Bailey too. That's awesome, man. How cool is that? You go Patrick Bailey, Patrick Bailey fishing, and you end up with a trout. Cool, good luck everybody. Brewstar Gratterall, rookie auto to 150 for the Dodgers, Brian Lutz. Ari Stennis Aquino, franchise 2020 uh, for the Reds, Kurt Disser. Robert Flossen, get used to that auto. He's really good. Oakland A's, Chris Walker. Gavin Lux, Franchise 2020, Dodgers, Brian Lutz. And Jason Dominguez. Look at this case. New York Yankees. Paul Townsend, Last Spot Mojo. 
<laughs> it's only fair. You hosted Bailey for USA Baseball? That's pretty cool, Jason. That is pretty cool. Jordan Yamamoto to 150 for the Marlins, Brandon Morocco. And Jordan Alvarez, rookie atomic refractor. Houston Astros, Jared Morling. Can you imagine this for a personal box, by the way? Robert Plawson and a Jason Dominguez auto? I'd take it. Nico Horner, Cubs, Eric Ainge. Jesus Lazardo, rookie auto. For the A's, Chris Walker. Bo Bichette, franchise 2020. For the Blue Jays, Justin Fuller. And Nico Horner, franchise favorites, rookie, Cubs, Eric Ainge. Ray, it's pretty fantastic, I will say. Jordan Alvarez, franchise favorites. Astros, Jared Morling. Jordan Yamamoto, rookie auto for the Marlins. And Brandon Morocco. Jordan Alvarez again and again for the Houston Astros. And Jared Morling, Nico Horner, Cubs. Eric Ainge, Gavin Lux, Dodgers. Brian Lutz. Max Meyer, number three overall pick for the Marlins, Brandon Morocco. Kyle Lewis, Mariners. Patrick Colon and Gavin Lux, gold to 50 for the Dodgers. Brian Lutz. What's up, Mike? How are you? Yeah, tonight, late again. Jordan Alvarez again for the Astros. Jared Morling. Nick York, Atomic Refractor, Red Sox, I Coppola, and how about another Max Meyer, third overall pick, Marlins, Brandon Morocco. Luis Robert, Atomic Refractor, Chicago White Sox, Paul Townsend. There you go, Paul. Brendan McKay, Rookie Refractor, Rays, Eric Bailey, Bo Bichette, Blue Jays, Justin Fuller. Another crazy box. This is a really good case. Artist Dennis Aquino, Power Producers Refractor for the Reds, Kurt Disser, and Patrick Bailey, auto for the San Francisco Giants, Jason Stowe. Oh, well, there you go, Patrick Bailey. There you go, Jason. It's only fair. We trade now. What's up, Grizzle? How are you? Nice uh, box for the Marlins there. Th four autos, three of them Marlins, two of them their number three overall pick. That's crazy, Jason. I can't believe that, man. Oh, I was just here trying to get a Patrick Bailey auto. Luis Robert, White Sox, Paul Townsend, Arias Dennis Aquino for the Reds, Kurt Disser, Jake Rogers to 150 for the Tigers, Eric Craig, Bruce Star Gratterall to 99 for the Dodgers, Brian Lutz, Brendan McKay for the Rays, Eric Bailey, Justin Lang. 
auto for the Padres. And Stephen Elliott. Later, Brendan. Have a good one, man. Thanks for stopping in, and Merry Christmas to you. Have fun down in Australia. Brendan McKay for the Rays, Eric Bailey. And Jason Dominguez, negative franchise 2020. That is super cool looking. I actually really like that. Black jersey with a white pinstripe. Yankees, make it happen. That is pretty cool. Uh, Yankees, Paul Townsend. Casey Schmidt for the Giants. Jason Stowe. Brendan McKay for the Rays. Eric Bailey. And Asa Lacey, Atomic Refractor for the Royals. And Rick Conza. Nick York. Auto. Franchise favorites auto to 50 for the Red Sox. I Capola. Kyle Lewis, blue to 150. That's really nice. Team color matching. Mariners, Patrick Colon. Owens Best is really nice. Uh, Igor, check your email. I'm, when I go through orders, I'll, I'll call out your name, but I. Uh, I got a hundred orders to go through. Just check your email. You you would have got an email confirmation from us on any order you placed. That's gonna be quicker than me doing it as I go through a hundred orders, and it'll be faster if you do it too. Reed Detmers for the Angels. Number 11 overall pick. This is another good one for you, Jason. I like him. He uh, should be the most MLB-ready pitcher. Whit Merrifield. Kansas City Royals. Rick Conza. Kyle Lewis, Rookie Refractor. Mariners, Patrick Colon. There you go, Jason. I like it. Dustin May, Rookie Auto for the Dodgers. Brian Lutz. Heston Kerstad, Purple to 250. Orioles, Nick Coba and Bryce Harper, Atomic Refractor. Going to the Phils and Matt Leo. And Nick Solak, auto for the Texas Rangers. Nathaniel Smith. Nico Horner, Cubs, Eric Ainge. And there you go. That'll do it. Very nice break. That was... 2020 Bowman's Best Baseball 8-Box Case Break. Pick your team number three from jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Sean, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time.